Making a successful flying machine requires doing a lot of things right, as you can see here. Many people have tried to duplicate birds. The wings must be large enough and properly formed to develop lift equal to the weight of the machine and its pilot at the intended flying speed. The machine must have enough power and an efficient means of converting that power to propulsion in order to overcome its aerodynamic drag and maintain the intended flying speed. If it doesn't have enough power and propulsion, it'll never reach flying speed and thus will never fly. It needs stability and controls to set the angle and direction during flight. And of course, a head start won't help if the key design qualities aren't already present. And finally, the wings must be strong enough to support the total weight. Or in other words, it has to all hang together. For thrown flying objects, adding spin can help stability. But just as spin helps stability, it can also hurt it if the device is not in aerodynamic balance. Watch again what happens when I throw this cardboard disc. Just as before, it banked to the left. Now I can throw the same disc without spin Watch what happens to it now. If spinning, it banked to the left. If not spinning, it tumbles head over tail. The reasons can be explained by a gyroscope. Gyroscope.